Hello there, Tommy Cannon fans. Thanks for buying this video to celebrate a great occasion. Believe it or not, it's 25 years since I decided to put this quaint little person on my payroll and treat him as a tax loss. Tommy, he loves to talk. Tommy, will you stop creeping the punters, please? You're getting on my nerves and just snap on a few snippets of our best bits and pieces, please. Would you like a little snippet? I love it, but it's a bit late at my time of life, isn't it? Right. Remember the old piano routine? Oh, you were a virtue or so then. Man, it was a long time ago, you know. Uh, do you mind? This is my video. I'll kill you yet. Thank you. And welcome. Just in time for a musical recital. A song. A piano. <laughs> and an idiot. <laughs> Tommy! Yeah? Don't put yourself down because I'm here to save you tonight. Yeah? The pianist hasn't shown up. <laughs> What's happened to him? There's been a mistake. He thinks this show is in Grimsby. <laughs> Who told him that? I did. No, then, listen to me. <laughs> Tonight. <laughs> Tonight. <clears throat> for your private listening, we have a piano, a smile, not a smile, <laughs> a song by Mr. Tommy Cannon, accompanied by his compadre. <laughs> Roberto Bob <laughs> to the piano. under your little bushel? I don't get them out a lot, Tommy, but when I do... Help ah, okay. <laughs> me make it through the night. Sorry? <laughs> Sorry? Help me make it through the night. <laughs> I've got a date tonight, Tommy. <laughs> I'm not like that. No. I'm not like that. No. <laughs> Song. Help me make it through the night. Oh, sorry, Tom. B-flat. Whatever you want here, B-flat. <laughs> You seem to have come in over me, into. <laughs> well, I'm sorry. What I'll do is, right, mm -hmm. I'll lodge you in. You, you lodge me in. When you have to come in, I'll lodge you in. OK. OK? Mm -hmm. OK, Tom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Jumped in again, haven't you? I'm in early. You nodded. I know you took it wrong, Lou. That was a piano nod. See? <laughs> piano nod. I see. So you'll give me a come in nod? Yeah. Take the red. No, don't! <laughs> so they don't notice. <laughs> so you won't nod me in? No. Take the ribbon. No, Tommy! <laughs> you were doing this on purpose. Well, explain it to me. Look, watch. Piano nod? Yes nod. No nod. <laughs> Come in, nod! <laughs> I've got it. 
I'll load you in. Okay. Right, and get it right. Okay. Are you ready? No. Take the... Come it! Come it! I'll kill you in a minute! <laughs> Come down. <laughs> Come down. No. Wait for me to nod you in. I will. Just wait. Okay. <laughs> Take the ribbon from your hair. Shake it loose and let it fall. Lay it soft against my skin. Like the shadows on the wall Come and lay down by my side Till the early morning light. All I'm taking is your time Help me make it through the night To be alone <laughs> Help me make it Through the night hey! 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 Now for a bit of drama Ooh, I love drama, me. I love drama. Don't forget, Tommy. I once appeared in Romeo and Juliet. We're far out there with Dolly Parton. Dolly Parton? She's not much of a dramatic actress. No, but she can certainly lean over a balcony. Ha ha ha! Kill me! Mm. Uh, dramatic reading. And now, ladies and gentlemen, something better. <laughs> <laughs> we have tonight, we present a dramatic reading by my friend and compat <laughs> by my friend and compadre, Mr. Tommy Cannon, who has learned to read, especially for tonight. Gentlemen, <laughs> I give you, because I don't want him. <laughs> Tommy! Cannon! Thank you. Say you're fantastic when you read, Tommy. They say that, do they? They do. Who are these there? <laughs> these there, them. <laughs> That's who they are. And they think I'm great. They do, Tommy. Well, I'm not. You what? I'm not. What do they know? <laughs> I mean, I'm just, you know, I'm not great. I no, mean, I think I'm, you're... I'm good. I mean, I, in fact, I'm very, very good. No, I think you're great. No, that's the trouble with you, Bobby. You what, see? Tom? You use that word, word great too often, don't you? Do you call everybody great. Hey, you call me great. I mean, I'm not great, am I? Oh. Hey, what about what about all the really great men of the past who made our history? Uh, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> a short tribute to the men who made our history, the great men who gave us our pride and our traditions. <laughs> Robin Hood. <laughs> Robin Hood. Robin Hood was the people's hero, the man who stood for justice and fair play in the days of depression and persecution. One man stood above all of us as the champion of the underprivileged. The great Robin Hood. <laughs> who robbed the rich and gave to the poor and brought happiness to those who'd known naught but suffering. Suffering? Not but suffering. <laughs> suffering but not. <laughs> Suffering, suffering not, Chelsea won. <laughs> he gave to the poor and gave to the rich. And then he stole off the rich and gave to the poor. So that the poor were rich and the rich were poor. <laughs> so he robbed them. So he hoped was the Chancellor of the Exchequer. <laughs> he 
He was a great man. A great man who had great tights on a long hair. <laughs> and he lived in a forest. <laughs> Robin Hood was a weirdo. <laughs> Churchill. Winston Churchill! A great orator, a man who inspired his country, who saved us in our hour of need. Yes! No. <laughs> yes! <laughs> who saved us in our hour? In our hour? Churchill inspired us. He took us through our darkest hour. His words gave us strength. We shall fight on the beaches, said Sir Winston. Never was so much. Owed by so many to so few. So few was never owed to so many. <laughs> so many never had so much few. <laughs> he said, we shall fight on the beaches. We shall fight on the beaches. Winston Churchill was the first skinhead. <laughs> contraption for keeping women pure and faithful. There's a lot like that in Chesterfield. <laughs> I'll tell you somebody else. I'll tell you somebody else. Captain Cook, the great seaman, who invented Australia. <laughs> Everyone was saying, where's Australia? And who should come along? Only Captain Cook with Peter Pan. <laughs> Everything didn't always run as smoothly as the last bit. There was a time when me and Bobby did some amazing things with a glove puppet. Remember the glove puppet? Yes, I had hand in it. Yes. <laughs> and you also put your foot in it. It's not like you to be funny, tell me. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. And now for something quite unusual. Yes! Thank you. <laughs> and now for something unusual, because when Tommy steps out from behind this cowboy garden, <laughs> you'll see something very unusual. <laughs> now get back here. It's a meeting. <laughs> That's unusual, isn't it? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Puppet Theatre. The art of puppetry. An old form of entertainment. Going back through the centuries. Adored by children and adults alike. Yes, indeed! The art of puppetry and perpetitions with puppetitions and the perpetuation. You perpetrate here and you perpetrate there. <laughs> so you perpetrate everywhere. <laughs> and you look at this with perpetration 
puppets. And you'll say, what the Lord of all puppets this is. Shut up and let's get on with it. Thank you. Now, for the story. The story of Dolly Dean. Corky Clown. Yes. And all my friends from the forest. <laughs> Sammy Squirrel. <laughs> Robert the Rabbit. That's my furry fox. Not only that, no. we've also got the wicked Sydney Fly Dog. Sydney Fly Dog? What the hell are you talking about? I'm telling them the story. Tommy, this is an adult audience. They're a suffocated audience. They don't want to know about Dimply Dollop. <laughs> and nothing. let's get behind the bike ship for a quick and right. <laughs> Now, just hang on, right? Now, this is a family show, right? Now, get down there and do it. OK, Tom. <laughs> OK, but I'm going to enjoy this. And now... <laughs> Once again, ladies and gentlemen, the story of Dolly Dimple... And Cocky Corky! <laughs> Corky Clown. Now get down there and do it. OK, Tom, I'm going to enjoy this. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. My name is Dolly Dimple, and I'm looking for my friend. <laughs> I'm doing all the voices. I love that. That's terrific. Right, get down there now. Bring Corky Clown up. I'm excited. I'm going to enjoy it. Come on. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I'm looking for my friend, Corky Clown. Here I am. You're not doing it right, eh? Now put it on. Now <laughs> get, well, get down and do it. Okay, I'm enjoying it. I'm enjoying it. <laughs> Hello, everybody. I'm looking for my friend Corky Clown. Here I am, Dolly Dimple. <laughs> Come on, let's do it. Come on, now, don't mess about. Okay. 
All right, now, kiddies, remember. Oh, if you go in the forest. Oh, if you go in the forest, you might meet that wicked Sydney fly dog. You might meet that wicked Sydney fly dog. Here I am, wicked Sydney fly dog. What's up? Now, that's not Sydney fly dog, is it? Well, how the hell do I know I'm an apprentice? Get the fucking off, right? <laughs> my hand's in that. Your hand's in that. You're really messing it. Now, look, right? You find me, my Sydney flight top, right? If you don't, I'm going to give you a dolly dimple, right? Right up your throat. <laughs> OK, Tom. I'll find him. I'm enjoying this. I won't be a minute. Come on. <laughs> Hang on. What are you doing? I'm looking for Sid. <laughs> That's Sydney Fly Talk. <laughs> I'm not sticking my hand up there. <laughs> I don't see why not. It's been cleaned. No, I'm not. Look, now stop messing around, right? Let's do it proper. Get on with it. Oh dear! Sydney Fly Talk's just migrated. <laughs> well, stop messing about, will you? And do it! Okay, okay. Oh, come on. I'm enjoying this. Right, come on. <laughs> Hello, Corky Clown. Hello, Dolly Dimple. <laughs> Hello, Donald Dog. <laughs> Hello, Robert the Rabbit. Where is Billy the Badger? Where's, where's Billy the Badger? Here I am. show this bit. I look really stupid in this bit. Really? That's very unusual for you. <laughs> Tommy played a third-rate magician and I was his assistant. Swishing here, swishing there. I were very good at swishing in them days. Mine were a lot looser than weren't I? Mm. But I must say after my performance I got hundreds of letters from magicians all over England. Uh, what did you get after your performance? 17 postcards from a sailor in Chatham. Mm. Sorry, France! <laughs> hey, come here! It's a bit 
Nietzsche, Nietzsche. <laughs> Where are the Yankees? They're in the washroom. They've got a bad cold. I've had to wash them. <laughs> Get the bike. What? <laughs> Get the bike. She's not with me. Can no! I? because it's crooked. They're doing it all over the backyard. I enjoyed that. Now here's something else for our thousands of fans. Tommy, before we go any further, could I just say a few words to the kind person who's bought this video? Of course you can. Auntie Lily, turn your volume up. Thanks very much from me and Tom for buying the video. It was your lucky day last Sunday when you went to that car boot sale, weren't it, Auntie Lily? Bobby? It was worth haggling over that 75p, weren't it? Bobby, stop talking about your Auntie Lily's video. Must be joking, I was there when she bought it, Tommy. It was a toss-up between our video and Carry On Cleopatra. Mind, she's very proud she'd have been a serious stuff about ancient Rome. Oh, good. She'll like this next bit, then, Auntie Lily. Distinguished. <laughs> a red ring by that distinguished, disgusting actor, <laughs> Sir Thomas Cannon, who will now do. <laughs> the burial scene from Julius Caesar, written by Shakespeare. <laughs> Of the dead body. <laughs> Julius Caesar will be played by, yes, a man of many talents, so Lord Bobito Bolo. Right, come up here. What are you doing? Look, just die, okay? Die? Die!
for the evil. on a ball on a garden wall and sure to lead to a farce. When I start to sing, Iris William, let's swing. And, and the next line's been cut by the censor. Beautiful. Thank you. Shirley. Shirley. That was fantastic. <laughs> Shirley. Fantastic. Not Shirley. That's not Shirley Bassey. I know that, don't I? Yeah. I can tell with the haircut. Shirley Williams. <laughs> Shirley Williams is a politician. I know that. What party are you with now? I'm going to join you at party. Shirley Williams is a politician. I'm Iris, the Welsh singer. We're in trouble here, Tommy. Shirley Bass is Irish. <laughs> no, no. Look, Iris Williams, that's her name. Is it? Yeah. What's your real name? Roy Jenkins. <laughs> Roy Jenkins! <laughs> uh, who's that? Leave her, she's mental, Tommy. Oh. <laughs> Look, I'll tell you what, let's do the duet. Yeah, let's do the duet. Excuse me, there's three of us. That's three true. Of us. That's true, she's right. Duet's for two. One of us is going to have to go. You're right, Tom. Sorry, Iris. Go and clean the window. No, no, no. no. Iris and I will do the duet. I know, but what about me? Well, you can sort of, you know, drift off and watch it from the side. <laughs> you really hate me, don't you? I don't hate you. You do, Tom. I don't hate No. Come on. <laughs> deep down, you've got her on your side. And deep down, you really hate me. <laughs> I've just said I don't hate you. Well, I hate you. Well, I hate you. What happens? You don't want me, then? Well, Iris and I are going to do the duet. You don't mind, do you, puppy? Puppy. Don't puppy. mind, dear puppy. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't mind. Go on, go ahead and do it. Leave me on my own. I hope it works for you. Thanks. Thanks I hope it's terrific. Thanks, Kev. I hope you get a whooping cough. <laughs>
the gray of December. next bit features that famous snooker smiling Steve Davis. Hey, you were a good sport, weren't you, Bob? That's Steve. Oh, I mind. He got very annoyed, you know, because I weren't taking the game seriously. Hey, the things that man can do with a snooker cue. Uh, mind it's healed up now, you know. Has it? Oh, aye. Mm. And now, for my part in this <laughs> extravagance, extravagance, in this extravag in this big show, <laughs> I'm going to do something with the help of my partner Tommy here, <laughs> or Tommy who should be here. <laughs> and you may say, "Where is Tommy?" And I will say, <laughs> "How the hell do I know?" <laughs> You've got no problems, right? This is going to be the easiest 50 quid you ever made in your life. It's coming now. Evening. 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 Tom, what? <laughs> Tom. Psst, hey! Tom, don't disturb me while I'm taking the shot. No, OK, Tom. Listen to that. Uh, oh, for God's sake, you just what? You've just knocked the table. Have I? Yeah. <laughs> Where is it? Pardon? Where is it? Well, it's right in front of you. Can't you see it? Of course I can see it. I can feel it now. Tommy. Mm. I want to tell you something. Listen to this, Tom. Get back. Get back. Oh, get back. What's up with you? What are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? Don't know. Well, I'm having a friendly game of snooker with my pal Steve. Oh, don't let me stop you, Tom. Don't let me stop you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How are you, Steve? See that? Makeup's good. <laughs> sure, he's a bundle of laughs, isn't he, Tommy? <laughs> well, yeah. I bet you have some good nights with him. No, now take it easy, right? What's up? Don't disturb me. I've only got a pot of black. Black. And I've won. Well, don't let me stop you, Tommy. You go ahead, you go ahead. 
Get a straight jacket, didn't you? He's mental, him. He's mental. Oh, great shot. Thanks, Steve. <laughs> Make that two straight jackets, two straight jackets. Fancy game or what? No. No more right, John, because if you talk to me about snooker, you're out of depth. Yeah, yeah. Because I'm four times champion, world champion, mm -hmm. of the Welders Club Rottenstall. <laughs> so you think you can beat Steve then? My daughter can beat him. Look at the state of that. Well, I've got 50 quid here that says you can't. Tommy, don't do what. Look, it'd be all right. Mm -hmm. Take your Valium. I know. <laughs> Tommy, Major will be here in a minute. Well, come on, you're so good. Is it all right with you, Steve? Yes, yeah, it's me. Okay. You stop interrupting you. You're a bit lippy, you are, right? <laughs> Now, come on, take my cue. Yes. You don't want that one. Take that. Oh, I've dropped it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you see you, stupid. Oh, and you're in the table, will you? Come on, Tom. Hey, what are you sorry, doing, Tom? Man? Sorry, okay. Tom. Steve to Brett. Keeps waving at me, him like that, doesn't he? Steve to Brett, come on. Oh, Jesus, what's up? What's up? Hey, what was that noise then? Oh. <laughs> Sorry? Balls. He's not left you much, has he? Balls? Yeah, he's not left you much there, has he? Tell me, let's be honest, he's left me nothing. <laughs> I don't know. Look, we'll have a closer look. Look, if you put the red in the top sack, Bring your key ball down the table, finish up behind the pink. No, what I'll do, mm -hmm. I'll put my red ball mm -hmm. in the top pocket mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and I'll... Mm -hmm. Don't do that, Tom, because that annoys me. Sorry. I'll put the red... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't keep doing that, Tom, because that annoys me. I'll put the red mm -hmm. ball and mm -hmm. then I'll screw it. Mm -hmm. I'm going to screw you! Mm -hmm. I've been with him for 20 years mm -hmm. and I'll... Mm -hmm. to play. Come on, no shot. I'll tell you this, boy. You're not playing with Tony Griffey, see you, because I can't play. Come on, no shot. Right, Tom. Great <laughs> shot. You Thanks. shut your mouth, you. That was a great shot. I know it, but I'm not okay. stupid. Great thinks shot. I'm stupid. Just a minute. What's he doing? What's he Steve shot. You said I played a great shot. I know, but it weren't great enough, will it? I must have missed. Oh, nice shot, Steve. It's not that good. It's not that good. Nice shot. Great shot, Steve. Look great at him. shot. He's getting on my pigging nerves. Great shot. <laughs> Come on, Steve. Oh, oh lovely to hold watch. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Now shut up, right? Shut up. <laughs> you, you've got me skin. Never mind your skin. <laughs> now keep quiet while he's playing his shot, right? Hey, keep quiet. Okay, what's the matter with you? There's a fly on this ball. Yeah. Uh, look at, look, you should be like, look at Steve. What? Ice cool. Ice cool? Yeah. <laughs> Stop. He's dead in. <laughs> Who are you looking at? Don't you sneer at me, kid. <laughs> are you sneering? Because I'll tell you something. Get! If you... <laughs> if you stare at me, you'll get the biggest break you've ever had. It'll be your neck. <laughs> What's wrong with you? He's not sneering at you, is he? That's the way he smiles. No. On the outside, he's smiling. Behind his teeth, he's sneering. <laughs> How old are you? 24. How do you do that? Are you Vince? <laughs> You won't live to be 25 if you carry on like this. Quite. OK, Steve to go. Yeah, just watch it, boy. That's all one. So stop waving at me. <laughs> nice shot, Steve. Nice shot, son. Well, that good. Well, nice that good. Nice shot, son. <laughs> hang on here. What's up? Something wrong no, here. this is delicate. <laughs> delicate? Delicate test. Hang, hang on. No. Hang on. This is... He'll, He'll never get this, Tom. He'll get it. No, he won't. He'll get it. No. He's missed. My ball, Tom. <laughs> My <laughs> ball, Tom. Oh, hang on. Hang on. My hang ball! On. Hang on, Tom. Get back, right? What's up? Just play it.
spot in the black, I've won. Don't you get cocky with me, boy! I'll tell you. Man. What's up with you? You ain't 50 quid. What's the matter with you? You've lost the game, haven't you? I haven't finished. Hang on. What do you mean you haven't finished? Can't see any balls on the table, can you? I can't see any table. <laughs> you're a bad loser, and that's the end of that. You're a poor loser. I'm not. Yes, you are. You're a poor loser. Show me up. I'm not. Yes, you are. I'm not. Yes, you are. You're a bad loser. I'm not. Yes, you are. I might be a bad loser sometimes, when you say you're a bad loser, you could be. And then there's times you might think it. <laughs> yeah. I'm not a bad loser. And to prove it, I'm going to say two things. What? See him there. Oh, yeah, I see him, Steve, yeah. Steve. Steve, Steve. <laughs> He's a nice fella, isn't he? Yeah, he is. And a good snooker player. Yes, yeah, true. I'm going to kill him! <laughs> <laughs> Come here, you! I know! I know! Come here, Spider-Man! What's wrong with you? Good job that table in the way. Pay <laughs> up, right? You're lost. Tell me, all right. All right. Control, control. Right. <laughs> Admit I lost. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go now. Yeah. And leave you two playing snooker. Fine. And I'm going to do my famous farewells. That's fine. Well, I want the £50 first. Talking to me? <laughs> I won the game. Come on, sorry. I won the game. I want the £50. You said... What? <laughs> you said what? Hey. Fair. 50 quid. The lad's right. Are you stupid? You've got your 50 quid. <laughs> I'm paying him his 50 quid. <laughs> well, where is it? It's on the table. <laughs> Have you ever wondered what it would be like if there were two bobby balls instead of one? The wife would be delighted. <laughs> well, that's what happened to me on a show once. I got confronted by the real bobby ball and another fella who looked exactly like him. It was Leo Sayer. He was made up to look macho and virile like what I am. Hey, I bet Leo's really proud to have done a comedy sketch with us. I wouldn't count on it, Tommy. It was him that sold this video to me, Auntie Lily, for 75p. Never. Yeah. Leo Sayer. Hey. He were good, weren't he, Bobby? He's fantastic, I Tommy. I know, he were fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> I'll, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Fantastic. I thought you were very good, me. Very good. Very good. Not just very good, no, Tom. No, He's the best. He's fantastic. Uh, you're right, Bobby. Come on, Bobby. You're right, Bobby. Psst, psst. Tom, come here, come here. <laughs> What is it, lad? What do you mean, what is it, lad? It's me, Bobby, isn't it? Hey? It's me, Bobby. <laughs> who? Who? Bobby who? <laughs> Bobby Ball! You're Bobby, your partner! We've hey. just done the dentist sketch! Let me tell you, that makeup is fantastic. Whoever's done it, it is fantastic, whoever you are. But I've got my own Bobby Ball, I'm not. Get him off, Tom. Let's get on with this. Just a minute. Just a minute. <laughs> He's him. <laughs> You're you, and that's him. Correct. I thought you'd made a mistake for no, me. No, no, I don't make mistakes, Bobby. <laughs> You're you. <laughs> You're you. Whoever you are. Correct. Where were we? Where were we then? Where were we, Bobby? Right, Tommy, right. Just a minute, I'm getting <laughs> sick of you. <laughs> Right. Now look, wait a minute now. You say. <laughs> you say. 
You're in. Yes. No, no. I'm no. <laughs> Yeah. He's in. Right. That's it. What do you mean? <laughs> hey, so he... what are you worried about then if you're you? No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm me. Yeah. Right. Yeah. But I'm in. No. <laughs> I'm not me. But I'm a bit in. <laughs> Good idea. And it'll prove to you that he's not who he thinks he is. That's a good idea. <laughs> OK, Bobby. Right. Do the announcement. Right. Do the announcement. Tonight, ladies and gentlemen, with the aid of my little compadriot, Mr. Tomoso Canoso, <laughs> we have for you tonight a little renderish... A, a, a little... A little render, renderish... 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 No, wait, I'll get it. No, no, wait. A little render, renderish... Songs of yesteryear. <laughs> a little, a little, a, a bit of rock and roll, thank you! <laughs> now that sounded all clear to me, right? That sounded all right to me. Now, how are you going to do it? And we're going to do it like that. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean you're going to do an impression of Bobby Ball? Tell me he's not Bobby Ball! You little poisoned boy! Oh, <laughs> Look at me eyes! It's me! Look at well, me eyes! I must be honest. No, I must be honest. You do look a bit like Bobby. What about me, Tommy? Well, I mean, so do you. So do you. It's difficult. I tell you what to do. Tell you what we'll do. What, Tom? Uh, do some uh, Bobby balls. Sorry. <laughs> no, you know what I mean. Do, do some things that Bobby does, right? Right. And I'll see you soon. I'll see you soon. Okay. Oh. Hey, got Don't. you now. Got you now. Right. <laughs> right. Okay, so, okay. Come on, this will prove who's right, I'll right. see who's who. Come on. <laughs> well, I don't know. I'm not sure of that. I'm not sure. Rock on, <laughs> Ball is right. The Who is it, Tom? It's you, because you're the coward. Correct. Yes, I am. That's hey. proof. Yeah. Well, I'll say that, Leo, that was fantastic. Oh, thank it really thank was you, fantastic. It was fun. I'll tell you. I tell you. <laughs> tell you what you've got to do, though. Eh? Now, I mean, you better pull that off, aren't you? Now. No, yeah, let me do it, better. Tom. <laughs> no! <laughs> well, that's it. A little memento of our 25 exciting years together. Bobby. Sorry, Tommy, sorry. I, I just... Sorry, I dropped off then. Comedy always sent me to sleep. What are we up to? We're up to that little bit at the London Palladium where I taught you to dance. Oh, yeah. That weren't you, you little liar. That were Lionel Blair. What are you talking about? Of course it were me. It's always been me, hasn't it, for a quarter of a century. Your pal, your partner, your mentor, your driver, the man who looked always, always looked after the mummy. Oh, Tommy, I'm going to be filling up <laughs> You did say you looked after me money, did you? Yeah, I did. Why? Would it be possible for you to lend me a fiver for a taxi to get to the station? What? And spoil a beautiful relationship? Sign off, Bobby. Rock on, Tommy. Bye, Bye everybody. everybody. Lovely, thank you.
Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I tell you what, great to be here at the London Palladium, isn't it? It's not so bad. Pardon? <laughs> I say it's not so bad. What do you mean it's not so bad? What's the matter with you tonight? Nothing, I'm all right, I'm all right. I know what it is. I know what it is. Shut it, shut it. <laughs> I know. I'm all right, I'm all right. I know what it is. It's women again, isn't it? Hey. It's women. You've got, you've got woman problem, haven't you? What do you mean? We're women? Yes. <laughs> That's what it is. That was a stupid. Hey? Ladies and gentlemen, look at me. Look at me. <laughs> How could I have problems with women? <laughs> I get sick of them. I go out with loads of birds. Loads of, I go out with loads of birds. Oh, yeah? How many have you been out with then? <laughs> hey? How many have you been out with? One? One? Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha! I've been out with more than one. Yeah? Three? Well, not as many as three. <laughs> shut up! Shut up! <laughs> I'm a sex object! <laughs> what do you mean, a sex object? When I want sex, the object. <laughs> yes, exactly. You know why that is? Why? Because you can't hold your own. <laughs> you can't say that! Hey, it's true, isn't it? Come on, be honest. You don't get a women... You don't get any women, do you? Come on. <laughs> Come on, let it out in front of all these people. <laughs> All right, I'll be honest. Mm. No, I don't get women. No. And I want one. <laughs> Wait a minute. You've got one, I want one. I know that. I love it. I've got to have one quick because I'm getting headaches. Never mind that. <laughs> Goodness sake. I think it's pressure building up. <laughs> I'll tell you what it is then, right? You want a woman? You know what you've got to do? What? You've got to go ballroom dancing. <laughs> ballroom dancing? Yes, I'm telling you. Who? You have. I'll tell you what, looking at you, boy, what? you'd make a good ballroom dancer. <laughs> Oh, yes, I can see it now. Please, don't laugh, I can see it. Can you? Mr. Big in the ballroom. <laughs> Shut it, lady, I'll kick your teeth. Hey! Put your teeth back in, he's only kidding you. <laughs> Tommy, mm. you think you can make me big in the ballroom? <laughs> I'll tell you something, right? I'm so sure that you'd be good in the ballroom, right? I'm going to teach you a few steps. Are you? Yes, I am. <laughs> Let oh, yes. shut it just a second. What do you mean? Oh, yes, I'm telling you, right? And I'll get a woman. And you'll get a woman then, right? <laughs> right, right. Look, tell you what we'll do, right? Okay? I'll be the fella, you be the woman. <laughs> what do you mean? But look, look, bro, don't take it seriously. Pretend to be a woman, and I'll teach you the steps. Then you can get a woman. Okay, I'll do that. Come on. Tommy, don't take the mickey, though. I won't do. What'd I do? Come on, come on over here. Fasten your dress. That's it! No, no, no! I meant your jacket. Come on. No. Stupid. Am I not turning you on anymore? Not like that, you're not. Now, come on. Behave yourself. <laughs> hey! What? Stop that. I don't know you that well. Come on. Are you ready? Are you ready for me, baby? <laughs> Music, please. <laughs> Shut me underpants right up my bum now! For goodness sake! <laughs> Pull them down and wipe your eyes! Sorry? Come on! Now follow me and get in step! Come here! Music, please! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? Oh. Right? You're useless! Absolutely useless! You'll never make a ballroom dance here, your legs are too short! <laughs> Shall I tell you about your ballroom dancing, Tommy? Tell me nothing. Shove it, shove it. Well, that's charming, isn't it? It's too old-fashioned for me. Old-fashioned? Look at me, lady, yeah, man. I'm young and sexy. I'll tell you, you know your ballroom dancing? Yeah. I don't like it. Well, I like my music funky. Oh, yeah? Yes! The funkier, the better. So what are you saying? I'm saying forget the ballrooms. Put me in a disco, I'll show you can hold their own. 
Oh, I see. So you're trying to tell me that you're with it. With it? I've never been without it! <laughs> Never mind that. That was very good. But listen, that'll never replace old-fashioned dancing. It will. It won't. If you want a girl, you've got to dance in the old-fashioned way. Look. You don't. You don't. Hey, Tommy. Who's the bird? Do you mind? That's a bit rough, isn't it? <laughs> what pet shop did you get that from? <laughs> Look at the to that bird. Be quiet. Tommy. You're supposed to be dancing with me, aren't you? I don't, will you? <laughs> <laughs> Get lost! Ain't it old fashioned, that? Ain't it? Rubbish! What are you talking about? It's old fashioned! Do you want a challenge? A challenge? Right! Your head right looks like a varicose vein. <laughs> Forget it. I'll sing a song. Hey, I'll sing a song. All right, what we're singing? I'll sing the song, right? Leave it, leave it, leave it. <laughs> leave it, leave it, leave it. <laughs> leave it. <laughs> I think he's a transformer. Leave it. <laughs> and I'll sing this song on my own. On your own? Yes. All right, then. Do you want to participate? No! I want to join in! <laughs> I'm part of this act. Right. Who do you think you are shouting at? Him. Right. <laughs> you think okay. I can do everything? All right. You want to join in? Fine. Tell you what we'll do. We'll finish on a song together. You can start the song. It's your favourite song. Is it? Yes. You'll do for me, Tommy. Right. Tommy? Yes. This doesn't sound like Pump Up The Volume. Get off! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a beautiful song in Vegas in 1956 when I'm in Vegas, OK? <laughs> yes. Just get on with it. All right, I'm getting on with it. And I can get it. <laughs> I believe the children are our future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. Show them all the beauty they possess inside. And give them Give them a sense of pride to make it easier. Let the children's laughter remind us how we used to.
Love, grin me a grin. 